What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy Spike back with another video, man. I already live out of the video. Hey. Also, I didn't worry about this. Guys, just let me be and allow me to do what I do. Now, man, I know y'all probably will be asking about the Blaze Night gameplay. Listen, I'm sorry. I don't know if the file got corrupted, but I cannot find the roster that I was using last time on Madden. So, I'm going to have to figure something out. But as of right now, we go pump out these Izzy slash Dez videos. I'm sorry about the Blaze Night, okay? I'm sorry. Um, I do, I do need y'all to understand though, as you can see, we in the Elite 8 right here, we in the Elite 8, but I do need y'all to understand, man, I did start back working, um, this week, I work Monday through Friday, literally every day, um, so it's gonna be a grind, but, you know, I got y'all boys, you know what I'm saying, I know y'all wanna see the content, uh, this is the year for us, so I'm gonna really turn up, and we gonna do our thing, you know what I'm saying, we got the 2K21 coming in clutch, and we gonna turn up this year, but as y'all see, uh, we are going up against Ohio State um, And I decided to you know boost the attributes on that boy DJ uh, Carden, I don't know that much about Ohio State. Um, I know about um, Luther Muhammad is the one dude I do know that played with um, Jelly fam in high school, you know, what I'm saying Javon Quinterly, but as far as the ratings I just kind of chose like I just randomized them um, I seen DJ Garden play, I thought he was pretty nice, so I just put him as the 99 overall. As y'all can see, you know, the fans, they've been going crazy for us, you know what I'm saying, like, we in the Elite Eight, this is probably, like, probably the first time in history uh, HBCU made it to the Elite Eight, so hey, that's a plus for us. Izzy had a goal in the beginning of the season, now, you know, we make it things shake. Now, so this is the Elite Eight game, we have the opportunity to punch a ticket into the Final Four. I do have the the um Dez gameplay coming. Probably not tonight though. I'm gonna try to get it out in the morning. So listen, y'all might have to wake up early in the morning if y'all wanna watch it. All right, I still need that same energy. I know it's a little early. Some of y'all be still up, just not waking up. Some of y'all be you know in the kitchen eating y'all Cheerios. I don't, I don't know. But listen, let's go hop into the gameplay. So as y'all see, they get a nice little backdoor cut right here, and it kind of started off slow. I don't know if we had. I don't know if he was nervous. I don't know what it was. But that should not have been a foul right there. You know, Ruff, I need you to help me out a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Like, as y'all can see, the arena is packed with the white t-shirts. We don't got that many fans in here. I know it's a March Madness game, but it seemed like they got most of the fans. So I'm like, yo, we just got to, you know, do what we do. Like I said, I feel like we could compete with anybody. And that's what we did. You know, we came in. Uh, you see, I'm throwing that down right there to TJ. It's six to six. They got the ball. They be running that. Um, man, I don't know what it was, but that was like cutting to the goal off of like flare screens. I, I can't really explain it, but it was having a lot of success off of that. As you see, they got the rock right here. Um, going down with that boy Luther Muhammad getting the buck right there. It's six to ten. They took control of the momentum early on. But listen, y'all see we moving the ball. At first we weren't getting shots like that. We can't really do nothing about that. You see, I'm passing it to that boy, Debo. And he missing the jumper. Passing it back out. I'm not getting it to go, but that's the shots that we want. As long as we keep moving the rock, you know what I'm saying? I feel pretty, you know, confident that we can come out on top of this game. You see that boy Rashad taking it coast to coast. In this March Madness tournament, man, I noticed I was going to have to really lean a lot on my teammates. Let's like, see, I'm getting my little TJ, and it's the beat full court, but instead of chasing the ball, I spot up. That's that IQ right there. I spot up because I seen that D-Bills go get the ball. I just call for a ball, shoot the nice little three. So they are currently up by three. I'm getting a steal right there. I noticed that the big man don't have high ball handling, so I'm willing to take that risk on getting a steal. You see, they playing, you know, they run a nice little two-man game right there. Luther Muhammad getting to the basket, finishing that. It's 11 to 16. I'm going downhill. And we spreading that rock out. You know what I'm saying? Trey Deuce, you know what I'm saying? My boy Trey, he's the go-to guy. Whenever I need a bucket, uh, whenever I need a three, I know I can give it to him. He gonna make the right play. And you see, it's 16 to 18. We throwing the lob. Well, they throwing the lob, getting it to go. And they took momentum in the, in, the, um, in the early moments of the game. But we just gotta keep playing. We gotta keep playing, trusting each other, and we can get things done. You see, I'm gonna get my stuff mixed right there. It's all good. 16 to 22. We got the rock right here. Uh, I got space, shooting a nice little midi. Whatever the defense gives to me, I'm going to take it. Um, I don't know what happened right there. They're getting a the backdoor cut. They got the ball again. 18 to 24. I'm getting backdoor cut once again. But we playing great defense, getting the ball back and lit. 
Hey, I don't know what to say about that. You know, some we got our stuff <laughs> boomed on, but it's 18 to 26. Like I always tell y'all, man, when you get the opportunity to run in the break, take advantage of that. You got to take advantage of that. Um, get easy buckets, especially when you got teams that, that play great defense. You know what I'm saying? So you see it's 20 to 26. Trey Deuce, look, being aggressive. Being aggressive, going to the cup, shooting a nice little layup right there. He playing exceptional defense. I'm leaving that boy DJ open. He hitting a deep three. We knew it was going to be a dog fight. You know what I'm saying? It's the end of the second quarter. I'm going downhill. I'm trying to be aggressive. I'm getting my rebound back. Pump fade, pump fade. Uh, and why? Hey, call that ref. Good call. So, at the start of the third, we want to be ultra aggressive. Hey, let me get those. Let me get those. You see, I'm pressing up on ball. Any opportunity I get, I hit Trey Deuce. He's giving it right back. I'm getting my shot blocked, but we're going to stay with it. Passing it back out to Debo. Going downhill. Making a defense collapse. Wide open jump shot. And y'all see, look, I'm on ball. I'm on ball. We got to stay aggressive. We got to stay aggressive. He got the ball. I'm forcing another steal with Izzy. I'm snatching. I'm shooting the jumper. We missing, but it's all good. Hey, I'm getting another steal right there. As y'all see, Izzy is on a, he's on a whole different level. You know what I'm saying? He got that dog mentality. I'm going down low, passing my boy TJ, and he finishing right there. So we want to really um, focus on defense in the second half. We know if we could get out on the break, like I said, we get out on the break. You know, so we could get easy, but ah! hold on, <laughs> hold on. Hey, watch your head, big dog. Watch your head. We got dogs, bro. It is war time. It's simple as that. It is war time. You know, we trying to bring home that championship. It's 33 to 31. They got the rock right here. We playing great defense again. Running in the break. Run. I'm good to my boy shot. He in a nice little mid range. We on boards though. Hey! Get boomed on. It's 35 31. You gotta keep playing. Keep playing. Keep trusting each other. Keep trusting each other. You see, I'm getting another steal right there. Debo cutting down low. Nice little uh, reverse like like Dominique Wilkins. You know, some of y'all youngest, y'all know about Dominique. <laughs> y'all know about little, uh, little Neek Freak. But it's 37 31. They got the rock right here. They going down here shooting a nice little jumper. Missing. But they're on boards. We playing great defense again. I'm running in the break. Running the break. Get to my open uh, open spot. I'm shooting that three. Don't even need to see it go in. Tell them is. <laughs> Tell them you like that little is. Tell them you like that. So it's 40 to 33. As y'all see the momentum is changing. We being aggressive. And I was waiting on a double team. As y'all see I was being patient right there. I trust that shot would hit those shots at least 70 to 80% of the time. So we comfortable with him shooting that jump. As you see Trey got the ball, I'm popping out. Izzy being real aggressive. 43 to 33. We doing our thing, all right? They got the ball right here going downhill. Uh, we playing great defense. We feeling good. Running in the break once again. Trying to get easy buckets. I pass off to Trey Deuce. Now once he hit that three right there, that's why I was like, okay, we got them boys in the bag. You know what I'm saying? Trey coming through clutch for your boy again. We gonna be all right. It's 48 to 33. They got the rock right here. They going downhill. I'm contesting that getting the foul, but listen, foul a guy before you let him turn the corner. You know what I'm saying? I'm breaking the ankle, uh, going downhill. Hey, I'm trying to bang out. That was a nice little, you know, nice little defense right there. But I had dude on the island, hold on. Uh, welcome to Izzy Island, where it's not sweet. It's not sweet over here. Uh, uh. And you not gonna have a good time <laughs> on Easy Island. You would not have a great time. They got the ball going downhill, shooting a nice little mid range right beneath the free throw line. And that's a that's a high percentage shot. Make sure I get that shot in y'all bag. So I'm passing off to Trey Deuce. That shot didn't count, but listen, we got an 11 point lead in the fourth quarter. We just gotta stay aggressive. They coming out, getting a dunk right there, trying to get the crowd into it. We gotta take advantage of that. I'm going downhill, trying to be aggressive. I know I want to force a lot of um. I want to put the referee in, in the tough spot to where he have to he have to call some. You know what I'm saying? I'll take my easy free throws and I'll live with that. You see, I got the bar right here going down low once again, passing off to TJ. That's his shot. You know what I'm saying? That nice little 16 footer out there. He hit those. We've been working on that in practice. You know what I'm saying? I know he got that in his back. It's 54 to 45, 56 to 45. You know what I'm saying? The play broke down. So hey, when you break a play, I'll just, just go make a play. 
Go make a play. Hey! You too deep under that rim, it's over for you. If you want to contest my shot, you got to be outside that restricted area or it's not going to end well for you. I'm seeing you that right now. It's 58 to 47. I'm going downhill once again. Get into my spot. Like I tell y'all all the time, man. Get y'all, get that mid-range game. When y'all get y'all mid-range game in real life, you're going to be dangerous. Because defenders, especially if you fast, they don't going to know how to guard you. Y'all need that in y'all back. I'm seeing you that right now. As you see, we get another steal. It's 65 to 47. So at this point, we know we have the game one. I'm getting another steal. I think I ended up with six steals. I actually don't have the stats for this game at the end. But here's a quick scripture on the screen. Like I always say, man, continue to keep God first in your life, no matter what you're going through, no matter what you've been through, man. I know some of you out there struggling right now. Hey, keep your head up. Hey, times will get better. All right, I'm here for y'all. I know y'all here for me. God got us. We go, we go, we go stay in this thing. We go keep rocking with each other. This is your year, man. Let's go and get to that 10K. Then follow it up by that 50k, then 100k. But hey, man, I love y'all boys today. I got more bangers coming soon. Um, like I said, I'm working on the Blaze Night series, so be patient with me on that. But hey, without further ado, shit boys, fight. And we are champs.